Today in this video, we're gonna be going over the new cat eye refresh. So yeah, we're just gonna get into it. Okay, I'm not gonna use that voice in the video, but it's not really a refresh. I mean, it kind of is. Um, the the mesh is the same for the cat eye. Sorry, what am I doing? Before I start this video, um, I just want to say I'm sorry for my two week absence. I've just been kind of living life with my truck. School started up again, so yeah, I just kind of got out of the loop with making YouTube videos. And um, since it's the beginning of the January, um, you don't really make money off of YouTube in January because all the companies spend their money on their Christmas ads, and they have no money left to spend on ads for January so that's why we get no revenue in January so that's also why I didn't really upload but yeah we're back hopefully so yeah uh, today we're gonna be going over the cat eye refresh and I also have a surprise for you guys in the middle of it so pretty much cat eye is there's something that pops up in the dealership here obviously for the cat eye but yeah nothing's much changed it's obviously still 2006 so yeah basically on most of the trims the only thing different is the lights hunter was gonna do a retune for this actually but I think he's gonna do that later because the current tunes apparently are fine to him when uh the Duramax in game isn't a six speed. So yeah, I already have the Duramax, so we're gonna get it. And the reason we're going over specifically the Duramax is because that shows the light refresh and the Duramax is one of the only trims that also has new sounds. So yeah, here's how it looks. Uh, nothing really looks different except the height is actually changed. It no longer is a grandpa truck stance or whatever. It actually is a proper 2500 HD stance and I'm so happy about it. I know Blox was obviously very happy about it too. That's literally his favorite part of the truck right now. But anyway, here are the new lights. We got our headlights right here. Way brighter beams, honestly, I love them. You have the running lights and the headlights are on right here and the back. We have the running lights. Those look good because they're actually neon now. And then uh, we also have our brake lights, which look so cool. They're almost like an orange tint. I love it. Our reverse lights look like this. They're not neon, but that's okay. And um, we also have our turn signals. Look crazy good. These new taillights, I'm so excited about. So yeah. Anyway, the main thing about this is the freaking startup. So yeah, um, let's get into it. Guess. And listen to that idle. The sound, the engine sound on this, unironically, unironically has an idle. Listen. It's amazing. It's amazing. So, yeah, let's just give it a little rev real quick. Jeez, this revs up fast. So other than the engine sounds, there's actually new turbo sounds. This is one of the only vehicles in Greville at the moment with different turbo sounds. And well, pretty much the turbo on this truck was actually taken from a real life Duramax. Same for the engine sounds. So yeah, this is like the most realistic you can get. And you guys might be wondering why I know about all this. Well, I'll get into that soon. So yeah, I'm literally so excited for this. And I'm actually finally going to drive the Cat Eye a lot in G because just... Oh my God. <laughs> oh my gosh. Still pull. Look at Paul. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, that's so. Oh my gosh. So good. So good, dude. So yeah, that is pretty much it for the refresh. But now we're gonna get onto why I know so much about the sounds. I haven't really told you guys this, but uh. I kind of have a hobby besides YouTube and it's sound engineering and well I actually did the sounds for these things and contributed them to Greenville now you guys may be wondering why do you not have the contributor bro in Greenville you gotta be lying to me well uh I don't want it um I don't really want that much attention but if they give it to me then whatever but I really, I really don't need that much attention right now so but yeah I actually did the sounds for this. Yeah, pretty much uh, the startup sound. I also uploaded myself. I obviously took it from a YouTube video. That's kind of the only choice I could do since you can't like, what, you're going to like make a startup sound from scratch? It doesn't make any sense. So yeah. So good though. One of the best startups in GV in my opinion, honestly. So yeah. And then um, these engine sounds I did make. So I made the loop. And well, yeah, I honestly really proud of these. So I actually have a different version of the Duramax sounds, which are a little more aggressive and actually take it from an aftermarket exhaust on a Duramax. But Hunter didn't put them on the truck because he said they were too aggressive. So I'm not even joking. 30 minutes later, I just hit him up with some new sounds that I literally, I honestly kind of rushed. But they don't even sound rushed. Like, I don't know. I uploaded my first draft of it and it sounded amazing. So I'm so happy with these sounds. Like just, man, it's just. Like, just listen to this thing, okay? I'm gonna go full scent. A lot of people that don't know much about diesels may be wondering, oh. Why does it only sound like it's like 1K RPMs when it's at Redline? Well, that's because it's a diesel. 
and um, it only redlines at like 3,000 RPMs. But it sounds actually amazing, so yeah. But yeah, anyway, we're gonna actually take a little field trip to the GV Discord to uh, see what people are saying about this, because I'm pretty curious to see the thoughts people have on this. I know Voxria, uh, shout out to him, uh, really likes the startup sound. So yeah, I'm glad we got some positive feedback on the truck. But yeah, we're gonna go in the GV Discord real quick and kind of see what they're saying about the sounds. So let's see if we can find any. So we're here in the Future Updates channel. We're not here doing a Future Updates video, but we're just gonna search uh, sounds. We, got, we actually have a suggestion here. This guy said, make the startup on the Duramax the idle sound. I just wanted this guy saying uh, this will be likely added when GV actually adds idle, so I'll probably give Hunter an idle that I have. I already have an idle loop for the Duramax, so I'll probably just give him to that. But anyway, we're going to look through here again. Uh, let's see. This guy's talking about a Taco Bell bathroom. Someone's calling them dumb. Let's see if I can find it. The headlights. Oh, yeah, here we go. All right, so this guy said, this guy said the diesel sound is nice. We did the headlights and the sounds. Someone said, anyone else hear how the 2006 Silverado sounds like a semi's Jake break? I honestly kind of agree with that, but not really because um, it's realistic to a real life Duramax. So it's pretty much saying like the Duramax sounds like a Jake break. Let's see. This guy said, I don't know what a Duramax sounds, but you can judge by yourself. He posted this video. I have a question. Since I haven't played GV yet, does the Refresh 2500 sound more like a Duramax now? Oh, yeah, and he sent the video and he said, oh, yeah, it does. Dang, okay. This guy posted a 927 new daily, but it sounds like a helicopter. <laughs> Why does it sound like helicopters? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, hold on. I can't be bothered. I'm pulling up a comparison of the Duramax IRL to this because this, I just can't be bothered. Okay, so this video right here has a little bit of a higher RPM in the Duramax. That's why, because it was retuned and stuff. So yeah, this is how this, this, is how this sounds here. And then uh, let's hop in here. Literally sounds identical to our. Okay, so here's this one where uh, this one pretty much sounds like a helicopter. According to this guy, it sounds like a helicopter. So here's this. As you can see, there's that. Let's accelerate this again. And you can hear that it actually sounds like a Duramax in real life. Okay, so we'll play one more. So this is an exhaust mounted clip. And as you can see, that's what it sounds like. And now we'll do a pull in GV. Yeah, for this guy saying that it sounds like a helicopter, I hope he doesn't mean it doesn't sound realistic. But if he just says Duramax is a general sound like hel helicopters, that's his issue. But in my opinion, it sounds pretty realistic. Uh, this guy said, I hope they have more of the diesel sounds the 06 2500 uses. The answer to that is yes. Um, I already have some sounds lined up, so there's some more diesels in GV, so yeah. This guy said, new engine sound sounds so good. Let's go. This guy sent that image and he said, does it sound like a diesel now? It said V8 sound. I'm guessing because he doesn't even have the Duramax. Let's see right here. Uh, Refresh 2500 sounds like a glorified tractor. What? <laughs> what? A glorified tractor? I mean, that's almost logical. And then this guy re replied to it saying, for me, it sounds like a helicopter. What's with these people saying it sounds like a helicopter? What? This guy replied to it saying, I love the new sound. And this guy said again, is it just me or the Silver Out update sound sounds like a helicopter? I think it's just you, dude. Uh, coming from the person who made this sound, I think it's just you. Anyway, I don't want I don't want to just go on forever. So yeah, uh, that's gonna be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, there's gonna be a retune for these very soon. Probably in the next update, honestly, which honestly might be coming out soon. So yeah, that's gonna be it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.